guys, David Sherwack here, and today I'm back with the fourth MKO tutorial. And for this one, I'm going to be doing um, the handle stall, earth turn handle stall to spike um, from the open division trick list. And this trick was suggested by Keo. I'm not going to try and say the, the rest of the name, but yeah, let's uh, get into this trick. Here's an example of the trick handle stall, earth turn. Alright, so there was an example of the trick. So before you start this trick, you probably want to know how to do handle stall first. So get pretty comfortable with pulling up to handle stall. Um, it's a really, I found it a pretty difficult balance because it's not balancing on much. It's just balancing on this bottom uh, part of the ken right here. So definitely get used to the feeling of balancing it. And when you're first learning it, it's going to take a lot of knees and a lot of precision um, to be able to land it and then especially do the earth turn after. I'm not even that good at handle stalls so um, yeah. Let's, but let's get into this. So first obviously you're going to pull up to handle stall and the grip is really important for this trick. So you can either pull up to the handle stall like this and have the logo facing up or like the Ken is flat like this kind of. You can either balance it like that or you can balance it to the side where the big cup is facing up, like that. So what I like to do is I personally like to balance it like this. Um, it just makes it a lot easier for me doing the earth turn. For some reason, I'm not completely sure why, but I'm a lot more consistent with it like this. So definitely make sure to choose which way you like more, and then you can start doing it. One more thing before you start this trick is bevel licks. Um, I know. It's weird, I did this in the double stilt flip tutorial as well, but licking the bevel, the hole, will definitely help with stall tricks. So you can definitely do that with this trick, um, it'll definitely help, so make sure to do that before you try this as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull up to handle stall. So pull up to handle stall, use your knees, pull it straight up, and really, you're going to want to really cushion it because like I said, there's not much of a landing space. So really cushion it, use a lot of knees, and make sure that all your fingers are out of the way so that the tama will not hit it. Because if you're competing in MKO and it hits your finger, it won't count, so really make sure that your fingers are out of the way. And if it's in this grip, make sure your fingers are further up on the ken so that the tama won't hit them at all. So pull up the handle stall like that. And now, as you can see, my fingers are not in the way at all. Um, and now I'm perfectly set up for the earth turn. So what I like to do is bend my knees, just give it a little bit of an earth turn. And one more thing that will help before you do this trick is being comfortable with bird earth turns. So if you're comfortable with those, this trick will be a lot easier as well. So make sure you're comfortable with those. Um, so once you're in this handle stall position, make sure, like I said, your fingers are out of the way. And make sure to just do a really light Flip. It doesn't need a lot of rotation at all. When you're first doing this, you're kind of kind of want to do it slow, so that it does a slow rotation like that. So you really have a lot of time to spot it and cushion it. So don't do a really fast flip like that. Do it really lofty, really slow, so you have a lot of time to spot the hole. And as the hole comes around, you're going to want to just place the ken right under, let it kind of curl over. Use your knees to cushion, and hopefully with lots of practice, you'll be able to do it. This is definitely one of the tricks I need to practice for MKO, um, because it's coming up really soon, so get practicing. Um, it's just a lot of practice, and hopefully you guys will be able to do it. So, yeah, that's going to do it for this trick. Hopefully this helped a little bit. Um, nothing too crazy here, just, just a couple of tips to really help um, land this. That touched my thumb there, as you can see. That will not count, so definitely make sure to use your knees a lot and that's really the key to this trick so that's gonna do it um make sure to leave your suggestions for next week's mko tutorial below and i think yeah next week will be actually the last mko tutorial i'm pretty sure yeah it will be so 
leave your tutorial suggestions for what you want me to do from the beginner tr division trick list, the intermediate trick list, or the open trick list, and I'll make sure to pick one. So yeah, like I said, that's going to do it. I know this is a super long outro, but make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Thank you.